What's going on everybody? It's Warren. Welcome back to the Cosmic Wonder where we talk all things Marvel and everything relating to the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And we have some crazy awesome news today about Keanu Reeves finally joining a Marvel property. However, it may not be the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but he could actually cross over with Tom Holland's Spider-Man, Venom, Morbius, and possibly the Sinister Six. Fans have been wanting Keanu Reeves in a Marvel role for some time. He's the number one voted person to play Wolverine and probably the number one person voted to play Ghost Rider. But it looks like he may be coming to the Sony Pictures universe of Marvel characters or the SPUMC in the form of Kraven the Hunter. And I'll dive into this report, but if you're new and you love Marvel, be sure to subscribe so you can stay up to date on all of the latest Marvel news. Now, this report is coming from the Illuminerdy.com, and they have a pretty good track record when it comes to breaking exclusive news. One of their most recent reports was the announcement that Christian Bale was going to be in Thor Love and Thunder, and of course, course, during Disney's Investors Day, the president of Marvel Studios, Kevin Feige, did announce that Christian Bale is going to be playing Gore the God Butcher. So, very good track record indeed from the Illuminati, and they are saying that the role of Kraven the Hunter is Keanu Reeves's if he wants it. They have not said that he has accepted the role yet. On their website, they said that they received word that Sony gave an official offer to Hollywood megastar Keanu Reeves to star as Kraven the Hunter in his own solo film. They say that the project is being referred to simply as Kraven at this time, according to their source. They were also given a description of the tone that the studio was looking for, and they described the tone of the movie as a mashup of Man on Fire and Logan. So for those of us who wanted him to play Wolverine, we might get sort of a Wolverine style movie if he accepts Kraven the Hunter. But what the Illuminati said is that there's no final decision yet. Simply, the offer has been extended to him to play the role of Kraven the Hunter in his own solo film. He has not accepted it yet. Now, a lot of us weren't really expecting Keanu Reeves to play Kraven the Hunter, and I know a lot of people are wanting him to appear in the actual MCU, not in the Sony universe that they've created over there. But there are some benefits to him being Kraven the Hunter, and one is that he could appear with Tom Holland's Spider-Man one day. As we've noticed over the past year, year and a half now, Sony and Marvel have apparently worked out a deal that some characters from the Sony universe can cross over into the MCU, as long as those characters only appear in Spider-Man films. So there is a possibility that he could technically be a part of the MCU if they decide to use him in that way. There's also a possibility that if he does accept the role of Kraven the Hunter, he could eventually go on to appear in the Sinister Six and go to take on Tom Holland's Spider-Man. And this would be really cool, because he would appear alongside of Tom Hardy's Venom, Jared Leto's Morbius, Jake Gyllenhaal's Mysterio if he returns in Spider-Man 3, Michael Keaton's Vulture, and many more awesome characters. As far as the actual role of Kraven the Hunter goes, Keanu Reeves is a really good fit for the character. A bounty hunter who is really good at hunting people down and killing them, and if you don't think he's right for the role, just go ahead and watch the first John Wick. Keanu does an excellent job of playing a character that hunts somebody down and kills a lot of people in between. So, not a bad casting choice choice. However, I'm not sure Keanu Reeves will actually accept this role. And here's the reason why. Kevin Feige, the president of Marvel Studios, has already admitted that they talk to Keanu Reeves pretty much about every single movie that they do. They talk to him to see if he could be right for a role in a movie, whether that's a hero or a villain. They talk to him to see if they can find a good role that's perfect. Now, they haven't found one yet. Obviously, he's not in the MCU yet, but this is exactly the same thing that happened with Jake Gyllenhaal and Mysterio. Marvel Studios revealed that they met with Jake Gyllenhaal years in advance before finally landing on Mysterio. They were just waiting waiting for the perfect role for him until they finally landed upon Mysterio. That's exactly what they're doing with Keanu Reeves. But if he accepted the deal with Sony to play Kraven, he probably couldn't play a character in the MCU after that because it would just be too confusing. It wouldn't really make sense for him to go play Kraven and then for him to go play Ghost Rider or Wolverine, and Marvel Studios probably wouldn't like that. After all, Marvel Studios didn't want Tom Holland to interact with Venom in the first Venom movie because they thought fans would be confused and think their universes were the same and they didn't want that. So they probably wouldn't want one of their actors playing two different roles, one in the MCU and another in the SPUMC. So I think if you're Keanu Reeves and you've been talking to Marvel Studios for years, you probably would pass on Sony. 
But at the same time, who knows, Keanu may think he is perfect for the role of Craven the Hunter and may accept the role. But let me know what you all think about this. Do you think Keanu Reeves is a good fit to play Craven the Hunter? Would you like to see him in this role or would you rather him play a different character in the Marvel Cinematic Universe? Let me know your thoughts on this in the comments down below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the latest MCU news. And for live updates, you can always follow me on Instagram and Twitter. As always, thank you all so much for watching. Woof woof.